Some local departments already have body cameras and use them. Others have cameras in patrol cars to record how officers interact with the public. But as 27 First News senior reporter Jerry Ricciuti tells us, there is no one-size-fits-all for police using technology. Girard could soon become the next local police department to equip its patrol officers with body cameras. Chief John Norman tells me administrators have been studying the idea for some time now. We want to show that we're not hiding anything. We're not, we're not sweeping anything under the rug. Niles police started using body cams a couple years ago. The Mahoning County Sheriff's Office has been using them since 2014. Improves the conduct of your officers, but there's also a level of transparency there. But other departments, including Youngstown and Poland Township, don't use them, citing legacy costs such as maintenance and data storage, which far outweigh the cost of the cameras themselves. In Canfield, where officers have had dashboard cameras more than 20 years, the department recently spent more than $150,000 for its own internal cloud system. There's agencies paying up to $20,000 a month to off-site store all this data. While the sheriff's office also has its own internal storage system, Green admits it's becoming both time and labor intensive and is considering going off-site. Not everybody has the same budget. Not everybody has the same manpower to handle this. Not everybody has the same IT. Uh, departments in their agency. Gerard will spend about $16,000 this year alone for cameras, equipment and storage to have its system up and running by this summer. I really believe that it's going to be better for our community, for our officers, and uh, it's well worth it. Jerry Ricciuti, WKBN 27 First News.